at all these chests. Yeah, and they're all labeled? Creeper, zombie, sheep, pigman. Curious. But what does it mean? Huh. Eggs? The sign says sheep, not eggs. Might as well throw it and give it a shot? A sheep? Is... is that a monster? That's not so bad. It is fluffy. The eggs all have creatures inside them. And they're all different colors. They must be, you know, color-coded what's in them. So, she can just spawn things whenever she wants to. The Founder must have to kill literally thousands of monsters to get the resources to make anything. That doesn't seem very efficient. But she doesn't have any other options. Stay on your toes! We're close! Ah! I can't wait! Let's take a look around. Source is a chicken? What? Yes. The spawn eggs. It's so simple. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. That's the Eversource? So the chicken lays the eggs, and the eggs make monsters, and the loot from the monsters made this place. Well, throw it in the minecart and let's get out of here. We're still taking it, right? The chicken that the entire city depends on? Are you sure that's a good idea? What are you talking about? We need to bring it to the people! With it, we'll finally be free of the Founder! But that clucking thing is what we came for! Hey, I'm with you, Ivor. Let's grab it and get out of here. Ah Adventure! Dude, seriously? Ah! <sighs> I knew you were here to steal from me. Ah! Uh, pain! Oh, she's too fast! Well, hang on a second. Let's talk about this, okay? I'm not sure there's anything to talk about. It's just like I told you, Founder. They're here to steal the Eversource. Classic Order of the Stone. You don't say. What? No! Don't believe them! Oh, Aiden, will you just shut up already? And I'm supposed to believe the escaped convicts? Aiden warned me that you were a pack of thieves. And here you are, prepared to make off with the one thing our city depends on to survive. Boy, when you put it like that, I almost feel bad. Yep. Afraid I'm going to be taking the chicken. It's mine now. What? This is outrageous. Aiden, don't do this. Somebody order eggs. Creeper, look out! I've got Aiden! Save the foul! Oh, you got me, Lucas. Got you. Thank you. Thank you. Lucas! I'll take it from here. Thank 
thanks to you, we get to see what really happens when you fall off the islands. Hey, you can't pin this on me. This is your fault. Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. Trusting the blaze rods, hiding the Eversource, I didn't do any of that. Hmm, I can't decide whether I want our death to be painless for my sake or excruciating for yours. Land! Impossible. That's impossible! Jesse? There! Can we get to it in time? It's gonna be close! Crap, you're down here too? Lucas, you made it. Oh, yeah, only slightly worse for wear. Ah, gotta say, Aiden's tougher than I remember. Mm, got me pretty good. I'm just so glad you're okay. When Aiden pitched you over the side, that was awful. Yeah, I wasn't a huge fan either. <laughs> ah, it was good of you to try and save the founder. Uh, speaking of whom, is she okay? She's just sort of Staring. Uh, let me ask. Founder? Miss Founder? I, uh, hope she's not in shock or something. We made it! We're alive! This is huge! Yes. Yes, you are correct. This... this is huge. <sighs> this has been down here the whole time. I forbade anyone to look for land below us. It was too dangerous. A, a lost cause. I just don't understand. Why did you never even look or send someone down? Hey, take it easy. She's having a rough enough day as it is. No, no. That's okay. I, I was too cautious. I didn't want to create false hope. And I was so certain that the only thing down here was death. Look at this place. Totally untouched biomes all around us. Yes, it's... All a little overwhelming. What... what do I do now? Well, how about you start with a few deep breaths? <laughs> first things first, we're gonna go back up there and kick Aiden's butt. Sounds like the start of a winning plan to me. Getting back up? My word, you're right. We need to do that. I hadn't even thought that far ahead yet. not a good sign. Aiden's made some big mistakes. He's probably in completely over his head by now. I can't believe Aiden could be so stupid. I can't leave my subjects in whatever trouble they're in. Jesse, will you please help me get back to Sky City? Stop Aiden. Help me protect my people. Of course I'll help you. You're the founder. Thank you, Jesse. And please, call me Issa. Okay, getting back up. Getting back up. Let's see what we've got to work with. Hmm, that'll work. What is it? Ah, oh, I see where you're getting at. Nice. We need to start gathering dirt as much as we can. Uh, how will that help? We're gonna build a tower of dirt all the way back up to Sky City. Grab as much dirt as you can carry. Oh, okay. That should do it. Jesse, what is that? Uh, what? What is it? It's the other half of the portal that brought me here. Man, what a relief. I mean, once you get that flint and steel back, it should be a straight shot home now. Well, guys, you ready? Yes, I, I think so. 
I, uh, I think I actually gotta sit this one out, Jesse. It got me pretty good. I'm just not sure I'm up for towering all the way back up there. But I'm really sorry. I probably wouldn't be able to keep up anyway. Yeah, you don't look so good. You should rest up, try and get some food. That's what I was thinking. Thanks for understanding. There you go, buddy. Thank you for trying to help. It was very noble. Hey, what's with the last goodbye tone? I'll see you guys when you get back. Oh, and give Aiden another punch for me. Will do. Come on, we've got an epic climb ahead of us. We've got a city to save. You ready? I believe so. And when I get up there, I'm going to tear those blaze rods limb from limb. Oh, I'm Jesse. I appreciate what you did up there. Trying to save me, I think. under attack by monsters, ma'am. Everywhere. They seem to be coming from inside the palace itself. Come on, we need to stop him. I'm sorry, Jesse, but I have to save my people. Take care of yourself out there, okay? And to you as well. Jesse, you're alive. Please, can you help us? Hang tight, Milo. your feet. But with all seriousness, how are you alive? I saw you go over the edge. Hey, quick version. You know how you all thought there was nothing but void below you? Yes. Yeah, that was wrong. There's land. <gasps> you speak truthfully, my friend? <sighs> well, I can't wait to hear all about it later. I gotta get to the palace. Thank you, my friend. See you on the other side. Taking over the palace. He's holed up in the throne room, throwing those spawn eggs everywhere. No one can get inside! You need to stop him. I know. Jesse, take one of these. They're all locally sourced and handcrafted. I use only the best ingredients. Got any potions of invisibility? Here! Can't stop what you can't see. <coughs> And get out of my face, Reggie! You're delusional, Aiden! The people of Sky City will never bow to you! You killed the founder! Yeah? Well, you're gonna be next if you don't shut up! Now you listen here! Aiden, you've lost! 
I saw you fall! You went down! You're alive! You're alive! He's the founder with you! Ah! What the... Reginald! Not one more step! I killed you once! I could do it again! Just you and me, Aiden. Just you and me now. Just... die already! Should have left while you had the chance! Someone else in the spotlight, can you? You just can't let anyone else win. Oh, it just drives you crazy to see someone else succeed, doesn't it? Aiden, look around you. It's over. Give up. No! You don't get to tell me that! You're coming with us. Th th thank you. Thank you, Jesse. <laughs> More than you deserve, frankly.
Jesse is telling the truth. I saw the land as well. <gasps> In fact, I will prove it to you. Ah! Wait for me! you enough. You've saved us all. So what do we do now? Everything's just so different and scary. What do you do? You go have fun. You guys were cooped up there so long, now you can go do whatever you want. Oh, Freeze, criminals! You're not going anywhere! I knew you'd stop him. Nice work. Now, this is just speculation, but I'm guessing they have some regrets. I knew they wouldn't get away. Yeah, I feel a little bad. They just got in over their heads. Way over. Aiden. Oh, uh, hi, Jesse. I'm, uh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry to cause all that trouble. I can see where it all went wrong. I've, uh, got some regrets, to say the least. Yeah, I'm sorry too, Aiden. It didn't have to be that way. I was just so... jealous. Bitter. And you had all this cool stuff going on, and... and I just wanted a piece. I wanted my time to shine too. I'd say you have a lot to think about. Yeah, yeah. That's for sure. Try and make a fresh start, okay, Aiden? Do something good for these guys. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Make myself a little house. Maybe I'll become a writer. I won't try to compete with you anymore. Attention! Attention! Hello, hello, everyone, please. This is your founder speaking. Now that we're all safe, we need to organize. Start planning our new community. Are you listening to yourself? That's insane! We were prisoners long enough on that island in the sky. It is time for us to run free! Build whatever we please! Wow! Those two just cannot get along. Jesse, I cannot allow my people to be influenced by this naive idealist. Bah! I'm sure I do look like a naive idealist through the eyes of an oppressive dictator. Just relax a minute, okay? Relax? Relax? My people are in more danger than they ever have been, and you want me to relax? No, you don't understand. It will be night soon, and that is when the monsters come out. If we don't prepare, we'll be in danger. You're just making excuses to control our behavior, just like before. We must trust in ourselves, be able to learn from our mistakes. The people need to build! W what do we do? Who are we supposed to listen to? Of course the people can build, but we need a system, some rules. Rules aren't bad. Well, I think you're both right. You don't want to just run around with no plan, but you can't schedule and organize everything either. People need to be free to try new things, but you've got to be safe about it. I suppose I still have much to learn. Thank you, Jesse. I don't understand yet, but I trust you. Well, Jesse, I suppose the era of Sky City is over. We may disagree about how to run this place, but I thank you for everything you have done. I guarantee that we will be telling stories about your visit for many, many years to come. The day that Sky City was liberated. Try and play nice with Milo, okay? I know he's a little crazy and you don't always get along, but he really does care about the people. Yes, I'm starting to see that, and I will do my best. You know something? 
She was a little scary at first, but she's all right. <laughs> I'm gonna miss that crazy guy. I guess we should prepare for nightfall too. Without another portal, we're stuck here. It's been a while since I've had to start from square one. Ugh. Just when I thought my days of punching trees were behind me. Oh, that's right. In the middle of all the fighting and everything, I almost forgot. When I was on the ground with the Founder before I totally found the portal. And you didn't say anything? Yeah. I'm actually gonna have to agree with Ivor on this one. Did I not mention it either? Because I could have sworn I said something. No, you didn't. I guess the moment just never presented itself. Come on. Oh, hi. Ah, oh, there you are. I'm so sorry about her. That's okay. Looks like she's having fun running around. Yes, I think she took it pretty well when I told her she didn't need to be the Eversource anymore. What are we going to do with you now, huh? What are you going to do now? The sides continue to be adorable, of course. <laughs> but that was a given. You're not going to eat her, are you? Don't be morbid. Of course not. After so long being the founder and the Eversource, now we can just be Isa and her best friend, Benedict. Ah, uh, that's a boy's name. Huh, what a closed-minded attitude. Jesse, I would be honored if you would take this as a small token of our gratitude. Thank you. Come along, Benedict. We have a lot of adventures ahead of us. Well... There goes the Eversaurs. Off to cluck and peck at seeds for the rest of its valuable life. Hey, Jesse. You okay? Jesse? No, I just saw those pigs. And, you know. Oh. Yes. He would be really happy to know you're still having adventures like this. See? Just like I told you, one portal back home. Ugh. I just can't wait to put this whole world behind us. Oh, is someone being grumpy? No! A little. I was just hoping for a real treasure is all. <laughs> Livestock's no proper treasure. Although I wonder what would happen if you put that tiny crown on a different chicken. Come on, guys. Let's go home. We don't Axel and Olivia here when we've been. They'll never believe it. That's not what I was expecting. <laughs>